so Paul, how did you put your team together? Did you look at a um, special mix of characters? When you're making the picks, uh, I, for me, a lot of data was required, uh, a lot of analysis, uh, statistics. Um, and everybody, as we know, in this professional game goes up and down through form. And you're trying to get as many people as possible on the peak of form uh, as you can. And the other thing as well, too, is experience as well. Do you have a lot of youth in the team and you need to add a bit of experience or vice versa? Do you have a lot of experience in the team uh, and you want to take a bit of a chance with some youth? So the circumstances will dictate to a large extent uh, as to where you go with the picks. Karen, you've been watching your team evolve. You've got some, uh, some great players, some youth coming in and some experience as well showing. Is there anybody in particular that stands out? You know, there's a couple of German girls that I'm watching because it would be nice to, for them to make the team in the home soil. Uh, Sandra Gall, who's been playing well lately, and Caroline Masson had a, a great uh, Solheim Cup in 13. Um, I think they're going to be a great team. It's going to be a good mix of, of the experienced players and also some, some youth, some young girls that are so much fun to have around. So, um, yeah, it, it'll be fun to follow them this summer. What was the hardest decision you had to make in talking about the wild cards and the composition of your team? The hardest decision, uh, no doubt, Karen, and it's going to be ahead of you as well too, is when you have to choose your wild cards. And it's very difficult uh, leaving some people out, and particularly people that you know well and have worked so hard to try to be in the team, uh, and they're just going to miss out. So those phone calls are never easy, and it was a very difficult thing for me, uh, leaving out particularly Luke Donald, who I have a great history with and played his first ever Ryder Cup match I was his partner with. and vice captain him as well too and then for him to ring him and let him know that he wasn't in the team was a tough uh, a tough call for me to make